Getting enough vitamin D is critically important for good health, and I've talked about this in previous videos. But with more and more people discovering they're deficient in vitamin D, people are having to take much higher doses to raise their levels, some as high as 10,000 IU a day based on their lab results. But I came across some concerning claims about taking a vitamin D supplement on its own. The information said that high vitamin D intake may promote blood vessel calcification and heart disease among people who are low in vitamin K. This is because high vitamin D levels causes hypercalcemia, which is excessively high levels of calcium in the blood. Hypercalcemia leads to blood vessel calcification. When calcium and phosphorus levels are high, calcium phosphate starts to accumulate in the lining of blood vessels. It's thought that blood vessel calcification is one of the main underlying causes of heart disease. Now, vitamin K deficiency is also associated with blood vessel calcification, as observational studies have linked low vitamin K levels to an increased risk of blood vessel calcification. But the combination of vitamin D3 and vitamin K2 has gained scientific attention due to their complementary effects. This study has shown promising results on the synergistic effect of combining these two vitamins in everyday supplements. They think this is because while vitamin D3 improves your calcium absorption, Vitamin K2 allocates where that calcium can be used. If you're not getting enough calcium from your diet, vitamin D may get the calcium it needs from your bones. However, vitamin K2 prevents the bones from weakening by promoting the calcification of your bones while regulating and reducing the damaging effect of the calcification and hardening of soft tissues such as blood vessel walls or around your organs. This study suggests that taking D3 and K2 together may help reduce the risk of developing conditions such as osteoporosis, kidney disease or heart disease. This study found that when taken together, vitamin D3 and K2 may help increase bone mineral density and strengthen the bones, which is helpful for people at risk of bone fractures, especially the elderly. And finally, in this study, researchers found that vitamin K2 supplements helped postmenopausal women maintain healthy bones. Women in the study took the supplements for three years and saw positive effects for age-related bone deterioration and spine collapse. So what do you think? Is there enough evidence to make you start thinking about taking vitamin K2 with your vitamin D? Or perhaps you're already doing this. Leave a comment below and I'll see you next time. Thank you so much for watching. If you liked the video, please give it a thumbs up, leave a comment below and subscribe for more upcoming videos.